Hello and welcome. So you made your love to D game and you can drag it on the love app and it will run. But what you really want is a standalone app that you can just double click so people can download it and play it and it should have its own icon, of course. Yeah, so let's do that. It's rather easy. The first thing for you to do is to go to the love website and to download the Mac OS X 64 bit zipped release. Here put it on the desktop, just double click it and you will get the love app. You can get rid of the zip file for now. Next thing, go inside your game folder, select everything, right click or control click and pick compress for items. Then rename the archive to game.love and use love. You can move that to the desktop for now and close the folder. We will not be using that one for now. And now let's rename the love app to my game app, for example. Now get your icon file ready. If you don't have one yet, there is a link to a tutorial in the video description and in the YouTube notes. Right click or control click the my game app and click show package contents. In here go to contents, resources and put your icon in there. At the same time you can and should delete the other two icons there. What you need to do next is edit the info.plist file. Right or control click it and open with text edit. You need to find the following strings. CF bundle identifier and the string here you need to change to for example com my game my game now look for cf bundle name that will be the name of your game and next look for ut exported type declaration and what you need to do here is start before key and end with array and delete everything. You might also want to change the copyright string and if you did change the icon you should of course replace it. In this case the OSX app icon should be changed to the name of your new one. Like in my case my icon then just save it, close it, and close this window. And it might not update immediately, but if you go to Get Info, you will see that the correct icon is being used here already. All it takes could be to just move a file, where it then will be displayed correctly. And when you move it back, it works already. In the worst case, you can restart your computer. However, we forgot the most important thing. We have to show package contents again. Go to contents, resources, and just move the game.love file in here. And now if you click it, the game starts. All that is left for you to do is to right or control click it, compress my game.app, and this zip file you can use to distribute your game. Thank you for watching, I hope this helped. Please like and subscribe and see you in the next video. Ciao!